Stage eight, 207 kilometers from Terni to a finish familiar to Terreno Adriatico in Fossombrone. A very, very active start to the race as riders tried to force the breakaway. Eventually, a quartet of riders had a small advantage. Trek, Trek, Trek Segafredo's Tom Scunch managed to bridge across. Five riders then went through the first intermediate sprint at Foligno. There was a battle for the minor placings that went the way of the Malia Ciclamino. Jonathan Milan just about edging off Maz Pedersen and Caden Groves to extend his lead in those standings. And then six more riders bridged across, all representing different teams. They were joined eventually by Warren Bagheel of Arkea Samsic. And he wasn't the last rider to get across to the front of the race as those two groups came together at the front. 12 riders then became 13. Oscar Riesebeck of Alpecin de Koenig joining in and making it a 13 rider break. Three climbs towards the finish in the final 50 kilometers, and on the first of those climbs, E. Cappuccini for the first time, Ben Healy from EF Education Easy Post soloed and went clear. That destroyed the rest of the field. And five riders were fighting already for second place as Jumbo Visma from the GC group took things up. Ben Healy then over the top of the second climb of the day with a healthy advantage of the Bargain Chase group. Over a minute down now, Ben Healy picking up 18 points for the Cat 2 climb. And then Primoz Roglic attacking on the final ascent of the E. Cappuccini climb and putting Remco Evenepoel and the other GC riders instantly into difficulties on the steep slopes. Matteo Gegenhardt and Geraint Thomas leaving Remco Evenepoel and getting across as the top of the E. Cappuccini climb approached to Primoz Roglic to make it three riders riding clear of the rest of the GC group and putting Remco Evenepoel under pressure. In the meantime, though, Ben Healy was about to take his first ever Grand Tour victory, soloing in style over the line to win Stage 8 for EF Education Easy Post. Derek G won the sprint ahead of Filippo Zana and Warren Buggy for second place, and then shortly thereafter came the lead group of GC riders, Roglic, Gegenhardt and Thomas. Good day for Primoz Roglic ahead of the individual time trial, and Remco Evenepoel crossing the line with Jao Almeida, under pressure and losing a bit of time. If you can go solo, it's always better. <laughs> um, I know in, in big groups like this, group dynamics can play a, a pretty big role in the in the finish. And yeah, I, I backed myself from a long move, and I didn't want to take any chances today. So yeah, I went solo, and I know I had good legs, and yeah, managed to hold it to the finish. No surprise that Ben Healy has won a stage of the Giro. He's been in brilliant form in 2023. 149 his advantage over Derek G in second place. And a great ride from Andreas Lechnersons to hold on to the pink jersey into the time trial. Just though, his advantage has shrunk to just eight seconds to Remco Evenepoel.